What is up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. As you guys can see, we are in the car with Jose. He's currently out there because he's using a portable air pump to put some air in the tire, but it's down a couple of pounds, he said. But we actually getting ready to head to the store really quick. It is a rainy day out, y'all, and I hate, absolutely hate driving in the rain. Like it gives me way too much anxiety. So Jose is coming with me. I hate to really like bother him and get him out the house, y'all, but I'll just be way too paranoid and nervous to drive out in the rain. But I'm actually just about to run to the store really quick to get some hygiene essentials i really want to go to walmart but walmart is so far so i'm debating on whether or not i'm gonna go or if i'm just gonna run to dollar general because it's up the street and they literally have exactly what i'm looking for only difference is i think they cost like a little bit more so i'm trying to decide on if i want to do that or what exactly i want to do i'm probably gonna just end up going to walmart because i don't think it's raining right now but that may change once i start driving for some reason that always happens so i'm gonna see when i get out there but honestly i need to go to walmart because i need to get sabrina some more dog food because she's out of dog food and i know what's tomorrow tomorrow is sunday so i know i'm not gonna want to i'm blah, 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 blah. i know i'm not gonna want to get out tomorrow to go get her food probably just gonna stay home but yeah y'all that is what's going on i just wanted to turn on the camera and vlog for y'all i want to like pick out something like a board game or something that we could do like at home since it is a rainy day and we literally y'all been cooped up in the house well y'all know we've pretty much been cooped up in the house anyway since jose's accident we really haven't got out to do much except like run errands and eat and that's really been about it we haven't really done anything like exciting so i want to see maybe if you want to get like a board game or like a card game or something like that that we can do at the house and have like a little bit of fun so we'll see y'all but he's almost done airing up the tires so we'll see you guys when we get to walmart if i go to walmart it's not raining y'all so i think i think i can make it to what walmart. if we get to walmart when we leave walmart and it's pouring i'm gonna be so mad because it always rains on me please Y'all just pray for me and pray that it don't rain, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I'm always scared when when it's like trucks like that that's carrying cars and stuff because I always feel like they're gonna falls. freaking fall. If it falls, like what do you do? Collect I mean, the check. You, you hit the brakes, you get what I'm saying? But it's like I don't look how it's moving. You see how it's moving? It's, it's gonna move. It's a suspension on top of suspension. No. When it is a rainy day outside, comment down below what type of music y'all like to bump. I feel like slow jams is just the, it's just slow the jams. vibe. Like it just sets the whole mood when it's a rainy day. Mm -hmm. What you like to listen to on a rainy day, babe? Slow jams like me, huh? I like to listen to me, my breath sleeping, my my breathing. You like to listen to your breathing? Yeah. We made it to Walmart, y'all. Can y'all believe it is 58 degrees out? Like it's kind of chilly. The summer's over. It's over. <laughs> Sad. No more summer. I but I'm excited to, I because fall to wear all is my, my favorite. shorts and stuff. Fall is my favorite season, so I'm super excited. I got it, baby. Go, baby. Oh, look, baby, a cart. So you can sit down. Electric no, cart. My ass. No, but just sit sideways. But then I'll be waiting for you in the store all day, baby. Oh, yeah, yeah. That way you got more room. Okay. Is it charged? All right, e babe. <laughs> you know how to drive it? You got it, babe. Look at all their costumes. What is this? Oh, milk and cookies. I like milk and cookies. That's cute, milk and cookies. Look, babe, we could be magic balls, babe. Is it just one or is it two? These are all the couples costumes. Peanut butter jelly. They got salsa and cheese. Well, chips and salsa. What else? I guess that's really kind of it. Those are kind of boring. Ooh, look at all the makeup. Babe, can I do you a makeup? What? Can I do you a makeup? Like a, a face? Why? Some cute fall pillows. Ooh, this one's cute. Hey there, pumpkin. Babe, hey there, pumpkin. Okay, where you go? Oh, I'm behind you. <laughs> I've been wanting to try these. The honey pot, I heard they're supposed to be really, really good. It's like, it helps like with, I think your pH balance and stuff like that. What do you do with it? It's a body wash. I think it's like for your womanly areas or maybe it's like for your whole body. Well, it says wash intimate parts with clean hands. But anyways, yeah, I've heard about them like a while ago and I've been wanting to try them. They got bath bombs wash. They got sensitive wipes. Oh, 
those are just wipes. And they come in different flavors, soothing wash, anti-itch cream. Okay. So, so far I got my uh, tampons. I got Sabrina's treats, Sabrina's food. May or may not get this. May or may not get this. May or may not get this. You got it, babe? All right. This is my favorite section favorite section of all time because i get to pick a different scent of body wash oh baby they got a shea butter and vanilla Ooh. i think i tried that one before though let me smell mm. babe i think i had this one before they have a mango and almond butter oh this one smells real good baby what else oh they have a new irritation care Oh, this one is fragrance free though. Fragrance no, I like fragrance. I like the fragrance. Ooh, okay. They have a anti-stress one. I'll probably get this one because. Ooh, babe, this one smells real good. This anti-stress is blue chamomile and oat milk. Ooh, I think I'm gonna get this one. Did I smell this one already? They got a um soothing care. Mmm, this one smells good too. Oh no. What's this one? Oh, I smelled the summer care one. Oh, I smelled this one before too. Oh no, it's between these two. It's between soothing and anti, which I think I'm gonna go with the anti one. Okay, let's let Jose smell them. Okay, so this is the first one. This one is soothing care can calendula oil. Can calendula? I don't know. But that one smells good, don't it? This one is the anti-stress blue chamomile and oat milk, which this smells so bad. Ooh, I like that one. Ooh, so yeah. This one, and then, yeah. you know, I'm like, okay, your girl you got oat milk at the house. been a little under stress, so why not get this yeah, one? Go ahead and get the oat milk. Yeah. We're going with this one. All right, what else we got to get, babe? They got freaking s'more pops. Do that look good or nasty? I've been wanting this so freaking bad. Jose's going to get mad, but I'm going to get it. Yes, a what? It's not raining. We, yes. We are on our way home and it's not raining. We have made it back home and now I'm about to make my hot cocoa buns, y'all, and watch my freaking favorite movie of all time. Well, one of my favorite movies of all time, which is The Nightmare Before Christmas. I'm gonna catch y'all right here. We made this before, so we ended up just going with this chocolate, the Hershey's milk chocolate, and then we got some little marshmallows, y'all. And then I also got, wait, baby, I'm missing something. My sprinkles. Oh. And then y'all got these little sprinkles. I'm gonna do the orange ones though. I'm not gonna do the black ones, but I'm excited. Oh, we got some burritos, y'all. I got chicken and cheese, so they got the uh, beef and cheese. And I'm kinda mad because I used to get the nacho chicken and cheese and the nacho beef and cheese, y'all, was so bomb. And I haven't found it in. They sold out of that everywhere. Yeah, They're and then of course, y'all know, I got my crush peach pop, y'all. I've been wanting this pop so bad. I didn't get none of the fall stuff because yeah, I was never gonna get it anyway. Sometimes I just like to put stuff in the cart and look at it, y'all. And it's not officially fall until the 22nd of this month. So, yeah. And then I got this body wash. And then Sabrina treats and her food. That was everything that we got. And that stuff was expensive. Ooh! Okay, y'all. So, here go my hot cocoa bombs. It's these two things right here. And I forgot how to make them. So, I gotta look it up again. First, y'all, let's light the candle so we can set the mood. <laughs> I love rainy days or days like this where it's just so gloomy. Candle lit is the flavor I went with. Well, this is the flavor I bought, y'all. Life is too short to be vanilla. This is the things Jose do. All that cold air rushing in is gonna make like, it. Like this is so scary right now because if this bowl fall, it's gonna bust and yes. I'm gonna lose my food. Now, y'all, let's make these freaking hot cocoa bombs. So, like I mentioned earlier, y'all, I got the milk chocolate. Hopefully. This is good. So I'm just going to melt them in the microwave. I think I can just melt it regularly. I don't think I got to add like milk or nothing to it. We don't see. But I'm only going to make one hot cocoa bomb each for me and Jose. I'm not going to do like all of it. Or maybe I'll just fill this whole side up so we can have an extra one. So anyways, y'all, I'm just going to pour some chocolate in here like this. I really don't know how much. We're going to do it in 30 second increments, y'all and 30 seconds oh, hopefully this turn out good y'all so our chocolate stopped so now we're gonna stir it up and then we're gonna put it in there again for another 30 seconds 
All right, 30 more seconds. Okay, so now we gotta stir it some more. Ooh, look y'all, so creamy. We're gonna do it for one last 30 seconds. 30 seconds on the clock. I have these two brushes that came with the uh, mold, but I think this is the one I use, so. I took it out before the 30 seconds was up because I don't want it to burn. Ooh, okay, see, that's perfect. So this is pretty much how you want it. Ooh, y'all, it's hot. All right, so now we can start brushing the molds. Here we go. I am done putting the chocolate in the molds. Now we gotta put it in the fridge for 10 minutes, y'all. 10, <gasps> hold on, it's hard doing this with one hand. Okay. All right, y'all, so now we let those sit for 10 minutes. I'm actually gonna put on the timer. That way I ain't gotta like guess. So 10 minutes. Once that 10 minutes is up, I'm gonna put another layer around the rim and put it back in there. I think for like another, yeah, put it back in there for another 10 minutes. And then after that, y'all, we should be able to assemble the hot cocoa bump. So see you guys in a minute or see you guys back here in 10. Timer has ended. So now we're going to pull out our um, molds. Ooh, they all nice and moldy. I'm actually going to add like just another layer around like all of them, y'all. Because some, I see like cracks in like some of them, y'all. But now we can do the second part or the second layer. Second layer is on. Now we gotta put it back in the fridge. And then we'll put it, the timer on again for another 10 minutes, y'all. So now y'all, we can go ahead and remove the molds. I'm just praying that they don't break. It already look like it's gonna break. <gasps> y'all. I feel like it's gonna break. Please don't break on me. <gasps> okay, so I think I did it, probably did it like a little too thin, y'all. So that's probably what my issue is. I'm excited. Here go the other portion of that one. I probably should get a plate to put this on. Let's finish getting the rest of these out. This is bad. So I ended up putting these in the fridge because they start melting literally as soon as I took them out. But look y'all, the bottoms are out. Except <gasps> that bottom went out too. I don't even know what to do at this point. So I left these two in here because I'm about to put some more chocolate in here and hopefully I can get a good one out of this one since I messed up the other ones. I think I messed up because it was supposed to be thick or either I messed up because um, I got the wrong chocolate. I'm about to put this back in the fridge for 10 minutes and let's see. So I went ahead and took out my cup already. This is the only cup I have that fit the hot cocoa bombs, which is a Christmas cup, but it's okay. And then I'm about to put some chocolate in here. I cannot believe my chocolate came out like that. I got the chocolate in the bag, y'all. I'm just gonna squeeze it till it goes down into this little corner right here. Let's try this again. This is how it looks, y'all. This is how they look since I added more chocolate on top. So let's try it. Let's break this off. Cause I honestly think where I went wrong, y'all, is that I just didn't put enough chocolate. Okay, so here go this one. And then we're just gonna do this real fast. And then here go this one. And then you need a tablespoon of hot cocoa. So we're gonna put the hot cocoa in there like that. Y'all see? Bam, like that. And then we're gonna take some of these marshmallows, a few of these marshmallows anyway. Bam, and get those open. We're gonna do like, mm, I don't know. Let's just do a few. This is how it is looking. Can y'all see? And then I already poured my milk right here. So I went ahead and put my milk in here for three minutes. I'm gonna let that get hot. My chocolate is melted. So let's finish trying to assemble this hot cocoa bomb. I'm gonna add just a little um, chocolate chips in here because I think it'll be fun. So I'm gonna add some chocolate chips in there, y'all. This is how it look. Y'all see my little chocolate chips? Now we're gonna take some chocolate and try to put it on the edges to seal the hot cocoa bomb. So now let's put this one 
on top. Oh, y'all, it's so pretty. And now we're going to put it back in the fridge because I'm waiting for my milk. Wait, hold on, hold on, no. We're going to drizzle some chocolate on top and then put our little orange sprinkles. That's what we're going to do, okay? So I'm going to set y'all down here. Move all that out the way. And then let's cut. Just so we're going to cut like a small little hole. And then we're going to drizzle. Oh, that's too big. <laughs> no, I just wanted orange. I think the milk is hot enough, y'all. It's steaming. I don't know if y'all can see it. Hopefully, if the milk is hot enough, y'all, it will pop. Like, it's supposed to, like, you know, pop once it hits any, like, hot liquid. So, here go the moment of truth. Let's see. <gasps> Ooh. There go one marshmallow. Oh, my God. Babe, I did it. Tell me that don't look good. That looks so freaking good. Now it's time to taste it. Hopefully I didn't put too much milk because I feel like this kind of need like two cocoa buns, but. Okay, y'all, here we go. Cheers. Mmm. It's so good. Babe. Yeah. You want to try it? It's so good. It is? Good? Yes. It's like chocolate all at the bottom, y'all. Look. It's chocolate like all at the bottom, but that's okay. It'll probably end up melting down some. Y'all already know what time it is. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, I almost dropped that. I'm about to turn on my nightmare before Christmas. Mm. Y'all, that is so good. I'm about to open up my window. Let some of that nice breeze in here, y'all. Hold on. Now we go to Disney Plus. I didn't watch this movie probably like a thousand times already, but that's okay. It's my favorite, one of my favorite movies. All right, y'all, so I'm getting ready to, y'all already know I'm about to watch my Nightmare Before Christmas. I'm going to close out this vlog right here. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel and you haven't subscribed yet, please make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. Do not forget to click the post notification bell. That way, you don't miss when we upload on the channel. And we'll see you guys in our next vlog. Peace. Thank you for watching.